We'll open the ImageMate Accent software by clicking on the icon here. You'll be able to see the live image coming from the document camera, and you'll also see some icons on the right side of the screen and the lower left-hand corner. So to use the tablet to control the document camera, we're going to bring the pen right up to the writing area of the tablet, and when we hover over the tablet, we can see our cursor move on the screen. If I bring the cursor over to the zoom in icon and press down, I can zoom in with the document camera. I can zoom out by pressing the zoom out icon. I can focus. I can also adjust the brightness. And I can pause the image here. Just press the same icon to unfreeze. I can also annotate on this live image using my pen tools in the upper right hand corner. I just select my pen and you can see that it will turn green when it's been selected. And now I can annotate on my image. Now we've given you two pens so that you can toggle back and forth. So let's go to the pen settings. There's pencil, highlighter, fountain pen, and straight pen. You can choose the color and the thickness here. So I'm going to choose fountain pen. And then to choose the second pen, you'll select pen two. And then you can choose a different type or a different color. We're gonna select a purple highlighter. When you're finished, click OK. And now we can make notes or underline things. And now I can just click on my pen two to go to my second pen and now I can highlight and emphasize key points. Now there's two ways to erase with the tablet. If you want to erase a single annotation, you'll press the button on the pen and then when you come in contact with that annotation, it will erase. To erase everything on the screen, you'll come here to the clear all icon to erase every annotation. In the lower left hand corner, we have some presentation tools for you to use. This first one is a mask. So when I tap on the mask or screen slide, the mask will appear and then I can use my pen to drag this mask around. So now for reading text, everybody can follow along on the same line, or I can cover up answers and show them when I'm ready. Just press the same icon here to take the mask off. The second icon here is a highlight feature. So when I tap on this icon, my highlight box will appear. And now using my pen, I can drag this anywhere on my screen and when I hover over the border here I can resize the highlight depending on what I'm going to be looking at to emphasize key parts and again just tap on the same icon to remove that highlight feature this next icon is a zoom and scroll so when you on this it will instantly zoom in and now we can pan around the image so we can see what's on this side of the page and then we can pan over and see this side and we don't have to zoom in and out and reposition the document or the 3d object or whatever it is we're displaying under the camera I can be from anywhere in the room using my tablet to pan around just press the same icon to come back to the live image the last presentation tool is a split screen. So when I tap on this, I'm able to see the live image and the still image at the same time. Now I can see different angles. I can show the front of a page and the back of a page at the same time. I can compare students' work to the textbook. And to get back to your live image, you'll just press the same 